Hi guys, in this video I'm going to talk to you about why your newborn baby might be crying like crazy whenever it does a poo. Our baby daughter, when she was a newborn baby, she had this issue. So we were like, oh my god, why does our newborn baby cry like crazy whenever it does a poo? So we looked it up online, as you do, and it's a condition called infant dysgesia, I will mention here. You can look it up online afterwards if you would like to. Infant dysgesia is apparently quite common in some babies. It is when they cannot control the muscles properly yet and it will pass after a while, but unfortunately for some babies this happens. Um, we, I've decided before I gave birth uh, that I would like to do um, potty training from birth. So actually I started potty training the second week. The first week um, we had um, a lotus birth. We did a lotus birth with her. So that's where the placenta is connected. I will put the link under, of this video as well underneath if you're interested. Um, so the placenta was connected, so I didn't really want to do potty training and walking around with the cord. So after the first week the cord was off, we started the potty training. I got a top hat potty from tinyundies.com. I will also make a separate video review about that and I will link that as well here. Um, and this top hat really, really helped her. We, we, we both saw a difference. We put her on it because we, we knew when it was happening. We, we, you could see the signs clearly when they start needing a poo. So we put her on it and maybe it was the positioning that helped her that was sitting upright like that. But we've both found it very it helped her a lot. And if you guys have any tips, if that happened to your baby, please leave them in the comment box below. Please mention it for other parents. We heard someone else mentioned uh, putting a cream on the hole. Um, we tried that and it didn't work. So yeah, the top hat helped us the best. It also really doesn't matter what kind of birth we ha you had. Um, I had an emergency C-section. I thought, okay, maybe it's because she didn't get the microbiomes from a natural birth. But it isn't the issue. A friend of mine, she had a total natural free birth and her baby had the same problem. Um, it took for our little one about a month to get over this and after the month she was better. Um, my friend's daughter, she took a bit longer, so it really, really depends on the baby. Um, we also checked with her midwife, the midwives and the pediatrician, and they'd never even heard about this infant dysgesia condition. So that was concerning. They just waved it off. Uh, they didn't even give it any concern. But obviously, as a parent, when you sit there and you see your baby crying like that, you do worry. So as, as I say, it's just, it's normal. Wait it out, and if you have any issues, always check with your pediatricians. But do know it will pass, um, and um, hopefully you found this video helpful. And please leave any comments below for any other parents. And um, if you like this video, please hit the like and also subscribe to our channel.